These are some skulls, paper mache skulls that my dad, a C6 quadriplegic, hand painted. And now he's going to show you a little bit about how he uses paint and a paintbrush. Hi. Um, I like skulls and I like to paint them because I got infatuated with the Day of the Dead holiday in Mexico, which is a celebration of life and death and rebirth. And so these are some of the ones I've done. And basically what I use is I have a cuff, it's elastic, but they have strap-on pipes as well. And you put them on your hand. Like so. Okay, then you take a brush. I'm going to put a heart right on that guy there. Different brushes are used for different things. It's better to use a small one and start small. Now also, I've got to open some paint. I'm going to put a gold heart on this guy. So I open the can. I use my lower teeth on the lip, lip to open it up. Careful about to get paint in your mouth. You squeeze them out on a paper plate. Which is nice because you can throw it away afterwards. Close it up. Okay. I like these skulls also. You can paint anything, but I like these skulls because like they have holes I can stick my thumbs in. You can get them in any craft shop. Okay. You can adjust it by biting it and getting the angle you want in the brush. Okay. And you try and figure where you want to put it exactly. And put some marker dots on there. I think I'll center it right around there. And I'll have my bottom right around there. And you work from there. Very important for me, I'm holding it on my diaphragm, not to breathe when I'm painting because otherwise it'll move the skull. And you get about just about the size you want it. And the shape, this is a little fat. And you slowly, slowly work it until you get the shape you want. The skull is not, not very smooth here, so I have a little bit of trouble, but... And once in a while I'm going to take a break and fill in the middle. As you can see, I'm going over a dark color. So I'll probably need a second coat. That looks really rough right now, but when I'm done, it'll look something like that. And that's it.